Hi, today in Greg's Woodworking, I'm going to show you one of my favorite hand planes that I own. It is a Stanley number 29. It's an old transitional type of plane. And I'll bring the camera closer and show you some close-ups of it. Have a look. So here is my Stanley 29 uh, plane. It is in amazing condition. I picked it up with another plane for I think it was 30 bucks for both planes. Here I'll show you the uh, show you the other plane here. Here's the other plane. I picked up so I picked up both of these for thirty dollars. It was a steal of a deal. Um, this plane, I don't know the date on it, but it's obviously an old, big. Um, it's a big plane, a big joiner plane, and I don't know what the brand is, but it works some good for the age. And it, this, it, I did not do any restoration work to these planes at all. These are all in original condition. Well, I don't know if they're in original original condition, but this is how I bought them for thirty dollars for both. That was together. So, so here is the Stanley. Number 29. I'll give you a close up of the front of the plane here. There's a the mark right there. Um, I believe this plane, sort of the early 1900s, if I, or late 1800s, somewhere around there, I think I read. And this plane is just in remarkable condition. I don't know how it stayed in this well of condition. The only problem is this handle was broke at one time, but that's no big deal. Um, it's, it's whoever had it before me glued it up and it's perfect. So there's a lever cap. Like it looks almost brand new. And um, there's a blade. Still could use some work cleaning up the rust, but it works. So that's how it is. Um, extremely clean on the inside, like, the original person who owned this must have not used it very often because, or just took really well, really great care of it. It is a Stanley Bailey plane, it has Bailey right there, by the front tote. It's just in, I can't believe it, the, the, the sole is flat, I mean, I don't have flat at all, perfectly flat, the mouth is in reasonably good shape there's a little dent there but that's it anyway it's just a beautiful beautiful plane and this plane is in condition is in remarkable condition compared to another one I picked up a while ago that I was just gonna use the parts off of I couldn't help leave the I'll bring up the other one so here is the other Stanley plane I picked up this one is in absolutely horrible shape. I think I paid $10 for this. Um, $15 for this and $10 for this. $5 difference. Just depends on what the seller wants to sell it for, I guess. But there's no, there's no markings on the front tote. And I just bought this plane because I saw it. And I figured... If not, if I can't, I know it's probably a bit past restoration, but I might be future video. I might try to restore it, but at least I can admire it and put it up on a shelf or whatever, or you even use the blade and the lever cap, the lever cap. That's in fairly decent shape and the blade is quite rusted, but I don't think it's beyond repair. Um, so yeah, back to this plane. This plane is in absolutely amazing shape. I don't use it very often. Because um, I just don't find the need for it. I actually use this one more often. I don't know, just because of the weight and it's a longer joining plane. But this plane is a beautiful plane. I don't think I'll ever let go of it. I just thought I'd show you guys. Because this plane is absolutely amazing. And it works great too. So, I don't think there's nothing that needs done on it. It is 
an absolutely beautiful plane. I hope you enjoyed that video. Please leave a comment, a like, or please subscribe to my channel. There will be more videos like this on hand tools, old hand tools, new hand tools, power tools, and project builds. My future project to build is going to be a live edge, either bench or hall table. I have a piece of live edge oak I showed in my future projects video. So stay tuned. There's more coming.